the US Navy just dropped a bombshell, unveiling its next generation fighter jet, the FAXX, and it's setting the world of military aviation on fire. This isn't just another plane, it's a game changer, designed to dominate the skies and seas, replacing the aging FA-18 Super Hornet and reshaping naval warfare for decades. From cutting-edge stealth to drone teaming, this beast is packed with tech that's got everyone talking, from defense nerds to global powers. Let's dive into what makes the FAXX so special, why it's creating such a stir, and what it means for the future of air combat. Buckle up, here's the breakdown. The FAXX, a glimpse into the future. The Navy's FAXX is the centerpiece of its next generation air dominance, NGAD program, built to take over from the FA-18EF Super Hornet and complement the F-35C Lightning II by the 2030s. Unlike anything before it, this sixth generation fighter is designed for carrier operations, blending raw power with futuristic tech. It's not just about speed or firepower, though it's got plenty of both. The FAXX boasts advanced stealth, extended range, and the ability to integrate with unmanned drones, making it a force multiplier in contested environments. What's got the world buzzing? For starters, the jet's range is a core focus. Rear Admiral Michael Buzz Donnelly recently revealed it'll fly 25% farther than the F-35C, potentially exceeding 1,700 miles without refueling. That's a massive leap for carrier-based operations, letting the Navy strike targets deep in enemy territory while keeping carriers safely distant from threats like China's anti-ship missiles. Add in AI-driven systems and smart skins with integrated sensors, and this jet is built to outthink and outmaneuver adversaries in ways we've never seen. The design itself is a head-turner. Both Boeing and Northrop Grumman, the two finalists after Lockheed Martin was eliminated, have shown sleek, tailless concepts with stealth-optimized fuselages. Boeing's version mirrors its F-47 for the Air Force, hinting at shared tech, while Northrop's design draws on its stealth bomber expertise like the B-21 Raider. These aren't just pretty pictures. The Navy's already testing prototypes with reports of demonstrator aircraft in the works. Why the buzz? A global game-changer. The FAXX isn't just a U.S. Navy project, it's a statement to the world. With China testing its own 6th-gen fighters like the J-50 and J-36, and Russia pushing its PAC-DP program, the global race for air superiority is heating up. The Navy's jet is designed to counter these threats, especially in the Indo-Pacific, where vast distances and advanced air defenses demand longer reach and smarter tech. The ability to team with drones, like the MQ-25 Stingray or Collaborative Combat Aircraft CCA, means the FAXX can act as a quarterback, directing unmanned assets into high-risk zones while staying out of harm's way. This jet's versatility is another reason for the hype. It's built for air superiority, strike missions, and even electronic warfare replacing the EA-18G Growler's role. Its open architecture lets it swap sensors and weapons for different missions, from dogfights to deep strikes. Plus, it's optionally manned. Pilots can fly it or let it go autonomous, a first for naval aviation. This flexibility has defense analysts geeking out as it signals a shift from traditional fighters to networked, multi-role platforms. The buzz isn't just technical, it's strategic. The FAXX is central to the Navy's plan to keep aircraft carriers relevant against modern threats. Without a jet like this, carriers risk being sidelined by long-range missiles and advanced defenses. The Pentagon's $500 million boost to speed up development shows the stakes, and Congress's push to add $1.4 billion more proves it's a priority, despite earlier funding fights. The tech, what sets it apart? 
let's get into the nuts and bolts. The FAXX is packed with tech that sounds like it's straight out of a sci-fi flick. First up, its stealth isn't just about radar evasion, it's broadband, meaning it's harder to detect across multiple spectrums, from infrared to electronic signals. This is critical as enemies like China roll out better detection systems. The jet's smart skins embed sensors directly into the fuselage, boosting performance while cutting drag. It's like the plane itself is a giant radar, feeding real-time data to pilots and drones. AI is a big deal here. The FAXX shifts from a man-in-the-loop to a man-on-the-loop model, where AI handles complex tasks like targeting or drone coordination letting pilots focus on strategy. This integration with unmanned systems, like the MQ-25 tanker or CCA drones, extends its reach and lethality. Imagine a single jet directing a swarm of drones to jam enemy radar, drop bombs, or act as decoys, all while staying stealthy. Engines are another hot topic. While the Air Force pushes adaptive cycle engines for its F-47, the Navy's opting for derivative turbofans to cut costs and risks. Still, these engines promise super cruise, sustained supersonic flight without afterburners, giving the FAXX unmatched speed and efficiency. General Electric and Pratt & Whitney are neck deep in development, aiming to have engines ready by the late 2020s. Challenges and Controversies not everything smooth sailing. The FAXX programs faced serious hurdles, especially funding. The Pentagon initially tried to slash $454 million from its 2025 budget and pause development to focus on the Air Force's F-47, citing concerns about the U.S. industrial base handling two sixth-gen programs at once. Boeing CEO pushed back hard, saying their new St. Louis facility can build both jets, and Congress stepped in with extra funding to keep things moving. Then, there's the Lockheed Martin. They were a frontrunner, but got cut from the competition in March 2025, reportedly because their proposal didn't meet the Navy's radar and carrier landing needs. That leaves Boeing and Northrop Grumman duking it out, with a contract award expected soon. Northrop's banking on its stealth expertise while Boeing's leveraging its F-47 win. The stakes are huge. Losing this could end Northrop's fighter ambitions, while Boeing aims to dominate both Air Force and Navy programs. Cost is another worry. With the program potentially worth hundreds of billions over its lifetime, critics question if the Navy can afford it alongside other priorities like the DDG-X destroyer. The Navy's betting on digital engineering and agile development to keep costs down, but skeptics point to the F-35's ballooning budget as a cautionary tale. Global Impact – Redefining Naval Power The FAXX's reveal has the world watching. For allies, it's a sign the U.S. is doubling down on Indo-Pacific dominance, reassuring partners like Japan and Australia facing China's growing might. For adversaries, it's a warning. Russia and China are racing to match 6th Gen Tech, but the FAXX's drone integration and range give it an edge. China's J-50, for instance, is advanced but lacks the carrier focus that makes the FAXX unique. This jet could redefine naval warfare. Carriers equipped with FAXXs and drone swarms can project power farther and smarter, countering anti-access strategies. The Navy's testing phase, now in operational and live fire evaluations, shows it's moving fast to get this jet flying by the 2030s. That timeline's ambitious, but with $750 million in recent funding, it's on track. What's next for the FAXX? The FAXX is more than a jet. It's a vision for the future of air combat, with Boeing and Northrop Grumman neck and neck. 
The Navy's decision will shape the defense industry for decades. Will Boeing's F-47 Synergy win out? Or will Northrop's stealth legacy take the crown? Either way, this jet's set to make carriers deadlier and keep the U.S. ahead in the global arms race. The road ahead isn't easy. Budget fights, tech challenges, and geopolitical tensions will test the program. But the buzz is real. This jet's a beast, and the world knows it. If you're as hyped as I am about this game changer, smash that like button to spread the word. Subscribe for more deep dives into military tech and global conflicts, and drop your thoughts in the comments. What do you think of the FAXX? Stay tuned, and thanks for watching.